OnePlus. While most OnePlus phones had been made available globally before reaching China, that wasn't the case with the OnePlus 10 Pro, which has so far been China exclusive since its early January launch. That's about to change, as the company announced at MWC that its latest flagship phone will finally be headed to the US, European and India by the end of March. But what's more interesting is that OnePlus appears to have reversed its decision, at least for now, to share a unified OS with Oppo. In today's announcement, the company confirmed that global OnePlus devices will continue to run Oxygen OS, whereas their China counterparts will stick to Color OS after their switch from Hydrogen OS since last year's OnePlus 9 series. In the case of the global OnePlus 10 Pro, it will launch with Oxygen OS 12.1 but will soon receive the Oxygen OS 13 update. No word on the model after that, though, except for the fact that it'll launch with Oppo's upcoming 150W SuperVOOC fast charging sum. Time in Q2 2022. OnePlus stressed that both Oxygen OS and Color OS already share a clean and lightweight unified OS codebase, with the main differentiation being the lighter stock Android experience on the former to cater to global users. That said, the company acknowledged that some users weren't happy with Oxygen OS 12, not to mentai on the OnePlus 9 rollout which was so buggy that it had to be temporarily suspended. OnePlus will have to prove itself worthy with Oxygen OS 13. All products recommended by Engadget are selected by our editorial team, independent of our parent company. Some of our stories include affiliate links. If you buy something through one of these links, we may earn an affiliate commission.